Here are some ways to save time using the new Properties panel in Adobe RoboHelp. The Properties panel has three tabs which present the key metrics for the assets in your topic. On the General tab, we can see the image properties, where it's stored, its alternate text, presenting it as a thumbnail that can be expanded, alignment, and all the items you might want to change. On the Styles tab, you can quickly apply headings. The Topic tab is where you indicate the title and author, and offers a convenient way to add metadata that can improve the search keyword experience. Add a description to make the topic rank more prominently in the search results. Or add conditions to the content or the whole topic and let the user determine what to show or hide depending on the options they choose using dynamic content filters. And keywords for the index. The Properties panel also makes it easy to manage table styles and templates. A right-click menu provides a speedy way to make precise adjustments. Speaking of precision, this powerful ruler lets you set margins using any of five metrics that accommodate your specification. Here's another example, a topic that is rather plain in appearance. We could apply formatting in the Properties panel to give this subhead a color. But let's apply a style sheet for consistency. That's easily done in the Properties panel. Now we can apply the heading styles. The styling effects are easy to see immediately. I would still like a heading 1 that is more contemporary. Fortunately, RoboHelp can use Adobe Typekit web fonts by simply adding a second style sheet. Now we have a nice modern face provided by Adobe Fonts. For a personalized demo or questions, please write to us, techcom at adobe.com.